Hi everybody, it's Faith from Fireside and Tarot. I hope everyone is well. Oh, it's been a humdinger of a day, humdinger of a week, you know? Okay, Capricorn, it is time for your second part of September reading. I apologize for the delay, I know I'm late. Again, been some rough energy around here, still battling it, but... We're going to get there, and hopefully we're going to get there by the end of the day tomorrow, so... Alright, this would be for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, for the second half of September, if it resonates with you, cool. It is your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given to you by the cards if you choose to do anything at all. It is your journey, not mine. I just read the cards. And if it doesn't resonate with you, it may not be your reading, but you have to keep in mind that time and energy are both fluid. And just because it's not resonating right now doesn't mean it's not going to resonate later. So. Also, all things can be vice versa and may play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. And you guys are welcome here too. Come on in and have a seat. I enjoy having you. Capricorn, before I get your cards on the table, I got to do a couple quick shout outs. First of all, to everyone who has reached out and received a private reading. You guys are amazing. Thank you so much for the opportunity to get to know you. And to uh, practice my skills. I appreciate you. You guys are great. Also, to all the subscribers, old and new, you guys are such a huge blessing. Thank you so much for hanging out, tuning in, hanging in there, watching us grow as a channel. And if you're a newbie, welcome. Enjoy the experience. I hope you enjoy it as much as I do. And if you would be so inclined, if you feel like it, hit the like button. Subscribe if you enjoy what you see. The notification bell if you want to see more. And if you think you have a friend or family member that might benefit, hit the share button. But I'm not going to twist your arm. Again, it's your journey, not mine. I just read the cards. So Capricorn, let's get your cards on the table, huh? Something just fell. Oh, that stinks. I'm going to have to fix that. The chime came off my wind chimes. Okay, where are we? Your overall er energy, 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 Capricorn is the hermit reversed. The energy of the person you're dealing with is the sun reversed, so... That kind of stinks. I don't know how I feel about that. All right, let's get your cards down. Okay. Hopefully after this cycle is complete, I'm going to get the camera mounted back up on the wall. So you guys can actually see what I'm throwing down. And it'll make a little bit more room on the table too. But until this arm gets better, it's just really hard to reach. Anyway. Okay. I'm going to set this aside until the end. Set it right here. Okay. And we will clarify with uh, the universal, I think. Okay. All right. How you feel about them, Capricorn, is the moon and the upright. Hmm. You may feel like there's things that you don't know that are yet to be illuminated. some clarity on that.
Too much. Oh. The devil popped out. Wow. Hmm. That's a binding connection. Can... Addiction? Like, they feel like you're addicted to them? Well, I'm not going to throw any more clarifiers on that because this is how they feel about you. It's the lover's card. So they feel a pretty powerful t connection to you, for sure. Clarity on that. One card. One card, please. One card, please. Okay, fine. Give me two. Holy shit. Hair Fitness Cups. They want it. Capricorn, they want it. This is amazing. Wow. Okay, how you see them. Page of Swords. Capricorn, I don't know why you're tiptoeing around this, but I think we're about to find out. I think it may have something to do with this Hermit Reversed. I think it may have something to do with this whole, there's a healing that needs to take place for you that hasn't taken place yet. So, let's keep rolling, huh? Too many. Come back. Too many. Okay, well, I guess I'll take him. Emperor, Hermit, Six of Cups. I think you may have a history with this person. Possibly. You see them as large in charge, possibly slightly overbearing. I think you guys have some happy memories together. But you're still unsure. You still feel like there's something that you don't know. You're still kind of trapped inside about it, aren't you? Hmm. Can you get another card, please? Six of Wands reversed. That's strange. You're not mirroring each other anymore unless you're standing in front of the mirror. They have the Six of Wands upright. They see you as a victory. You're like a freaking trophy. Okay? Reversed, five of cups reversed. You're an end to their sadness. What's this full reversed? I think that they feel like you don't trust them.
Page of Cups, possibly they, they see this as it's not being reciprocated for whatever reason. I mean, they want it all with you. But they're seeing you as somebody who just can't express it back. Hmm. Ah, okay. It's all unfolding to me now. That's why they're not so happy. Okay. Is what you're supposed to be learning from this Capricorn, Four of Swords. Clarify on that, please. Queen of Swords reversed. Power reversed. Okay. Laying something to rest. Being kind with your words. One more for this tower. One more for the tower, please. I went to flip one, I flipped three. Sun reversed, lovers reversed, queen of pentacles. Huh. Capricorn, why are you so scared? like you're almost terrified that if you jump into this the tower is going to fall. So you don't want to take the next step because you're afraid of a tower falling. It's like you don't trust it. Their lesson is the Ace of Pentacles. Can I get a clarifier for this Ace of Pentacles, please? Three swords reversed. Oh, what fell? Knight of Pentacles reversed. Moon reversed. Nine of Cups. Stop there. Crap falling all over the place.
one more. Ah, uh, Seven of Swords. I think there's something they're not telling you. The Nine of Cups reversed overindulgence. One more. Five of Wands. I'm hearing Jekyll and Hyde. I think this is an old seed that was planted in the past, Capricorn. I do. I think this has been around and round. But I think this seed has been watered with things it should have been watered with. I think there was a lot of conflict. I think possibly the person you're dealing with had, had some issues. I'm hearing addiction, possible chemical dependency. There's heartbreak here. Things go stagnant round and round. There's things that they don't tell you. They're keeping things from you. There's conflict. I think the lesson they're supposed to be learning here is that they want this seed to grow. They got to knock their crap off. One more. Yeah. King of Cups reversed. They don't have a thing to offer you if this crap doesn't stop. I don't judge. You know, Big Mama Sage doesn't judge. I've had my I've had my own issues with chemical dependency. I've made no secret about that. But that was before I had a family. It was before I grew up, I guess you can say. We all grow up in our own space. It's our own journey. And some things are a matter of divine timing. Okay. Hidden desires. Capricorn's hidden desires. Eight of Pentacles. What's that madness all about? Can I get a clarifier? The overindulgence doesn't have to be in chemicals either. It can be just things that you enjoy a little bit too much. It could be binging on video games, gambling, sex, you know, all sorts of things. People overindulge on things all the time. It doesn't always have to be drugs and alcohol. Queen of Wands. Huh, one more, one more, one more, one more. You. You're not seeing this as a balanced connection. I think this Eight of Pentacles for the Hidden Desires is talking about working on this a little bit more. Waiting for the balance to come in because you don't see it as balanced yet. One more. 
Ten of Pentacles. I'm thinking you want money to be in the bank first before you go any further with this. And by money in the bank, I mean you want things to be stable. Things aren't stable enough for you yet. I think you see this as more of a sexual connection at this point with the king of, with the Queen of Wands and not really as stable in any other aspect. person you're dealing with hidden desires and nine of wands. Okay. Can I get a clarifier? Can I get a jumper, please, universe? Can I get a jumper? Whoa, what jumped? Magician reversed. Too many. What fell? Oh, what fell and showed itself? Two of cups. Nine of wands, magician reverse, two of cups. of Wands reversed. I think they want you to let your guard down a little bit, Capricorn. They don't want you to throw the towel in. They, they embrace this connection. One more. One more. Eight of Cups reversed. Ooh. I'm going to stop there. In a minute, I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why I stopped there in a second. They want to return. This could be somebody you're disconnected from at this point. They want to return to you. They want... This is somebody you're not with. They want you back. They want to come back. They want to come back right. Your conscious desire is the magician reversed. Their hidden desire, a clarifier, is a magician reversed. Capricorn, this is getting a little weird. Just saying. Before I clarify your magician reversed, their conscious desire is an eight of cups reversed. Their last clarifier for their hidden desire is an eight of cups reversed. They want to come back. I'm going to leave them alone for now. I want... I'm going to clarify this Magician Reverse for you. I'm at 24 minutes. I don't want this video to end on me before I'm done. So, Nine of Wands. King of Wands upright. Oh. This is a page of wands over here. Why did I think that was a king? Changes things a little bit. But not that much.
Capricorn, you want to move forward with this, but your guard's up. You feel like you can't manifest it. They want to return to you. What binds you is the Empress Reversed. The World Card. Judgment Reversed. This was a cycle that closed out. One of you feels like there's no hope for growth or expansion. It can't be resurrected and needs to be over. The other side wants to pick the pieces up. Get communication back and start over. But you're both kind of afraid of doing something you're going to regret. Because you've had too many regrets already. Challenge, Four of Pentacles. Somebody's holding on to something. I don't know if it's you holding on to the past, Capricorn, or what? Or them holding on to their addictions. Let's get a clarifier. Page of Swords reversed. No communication. You're not talking about it. Three of Pentacles. No teamwork. No coming together. Four of swords and not be able to lay something to rest. Advice, knight of pentacles reversed. Knight of cups reversed, hangman reversed. One more. Advice exploring all the options. Don't don't be emotionally stuck on the past. Don't not communicate. One more, or you're never going to move forward. Bottom of the deck, three of cups reversed. Where'd you go? Bottom of the deck, three of wands reversed. Well, Capricorn, whatever you guys are going to do, don't wait too long. Somebody's, somebody's got to give here. Somebody's got to communicate. It's obvious, Capricorn, that they want you back. If there's just too much in the past, it's your journey. Not mine. I just read the cards. But I think this person has deep emotion for you. So, well, this is what I got. You know that you loved. Be blessed. This was wild how it came together, though. This was great. This is crazy. Um... I'm going to get out of here for a little bit. I'm going to go take care of some things before I do the Pisces re or Aquarius reading. Ugh, getting ahead of myself. Much love. Be blessed. Mwah. Bye for now.